Hello all. Welcome to Amara. Today we are going to make a fish pendant with matching earrings. Before we start the video, I would request all my viewers to kindly subscribe to my channel and watch the complete video. Let's start with the tutorial. We'll require a thin sheet of clay and also a few wooden blocks with random designs. We are making imprints using these wooden blocks with different designs. The idea here is to complete the entire sheet of clay with these imprints. You can use the same wooden block and fill in the entire sheet of clay with the design or you can use different designs like these and make imprints throughout the clay. Here I am using a bell shaped cookie cutter and also a heart shaped cookie cutter. The pendant base is ready. Let's keep it aside. Now let's make the earring. For this we'll require a thin sheet of clay. Repeat the same process by making imprints using the wooden blocks throughout the clay. Press the wooden blocks throughout the clay sheet and fill in the entire clay sheet with the imprints. Take a small cutter like this and cut two designs as I've shown. This is for the earring base and the pendant base, both are ready. Now let's make the pendant. Cut pieces like these using a knife or a sharp cutter. Take the heart shaped cookie cutter and make the shape of a mouth. Now take a pen cap to make the eyes of the fish. The pendant base is ready now. Let's roll another thin sheet of clay. This is the second design for the earrings. Repeat the process which we did for the first earring. Make random designs like this. For this we need not completely uh, fill in the clay with the imprints. Just cut the fish designs for the earrings. Smoothen the edges. And now cut it into equal pieces just like we did for the pendant. Smoothen the edges. And now we are going to use a toothpick or a needle and pierce holes from the center of each of these parts. We have to repeat it with each part that is making holes through the center and piercing it throughout. We have to repeat this process for the pendant as well. So each part we have to pierce hole through the center for the pendant base as well. You can use either a toothpick or a needle. So now our uh, earring base is ready. Keep it aside for drying. We have repeated the same thing with the pendant base as well. Make an impression for the eyes. As you can see, we are using a small straw for doing that. The pendant base and the earring base are both ready. We need to assemble the pendant and also the earring base. For that, please watch my next video. Thank you for watching. Do support my channel and subscribe to my channel. Goodbye.